Relational operators. An if-else expression usually contains relational operators which evaluate the expression to either true or false. And each operator involves two operands, such as A and B in the examples below. So the greater than operator is just the right caret symbol right here. And an example is A is greater than B. Caret symbol pointing to the left is A is less than B. And the combination of the greater than and the equal sign stands for greater than or equal to. So in this example, A is greater than or equal to B, or A is less than or equal to B. Two equal signs in a row is equality in Java. It checks if A is equal to B. And the double equal sign should only be used for comparing variables of the primitive data type. You should not compare objects using the double equal sign. Also, the exclamation mark equal sign stands for the not equal operator, meaning A is not equal to B. And let's take a look at some of these examples. So let's create a couple of variables and test out these are relational operators. So int temp for temperature is 75. If the temp is greater than 80, we can print out system that out that print line. It's hot outside. And this will print out nothing because this condition is false. But if as soon as the temperature is 85, it's hot outside. But if the temperature was exactly 80, it doesn't print out anything because this condition is now false. 80 is not greater than 80, but 80 is greater than or equal to 80. So this is the greater than or equal to sign. And it says that it's hot outside. And let's try the, the less than operator. So temp is less than or equal to 32. It's freezing outside. So is it freezing? Nope, because it's 80 degrees. But if it was 20 degrees, now it's freezing outside. But if it was exactly 32 degrees, it's still freezing outside because of the less than or equal to operator. If it was just less than 32, then this condition would be false and nothing will get printed out. If the temperature was exactly 32, we could say it's the freezing temperature. So this is how we check for equality. Is temp exactly 32? It's true. But what if it was 31? Then it doesn't do anything because this condition is false. But if it's anything that's not 32, we could say it's not the freezing temperature. So 31, it's not the freezing temperature. 33, not the freezing temperature, but 32 doesn't print out anything because that condition is false. So these are just from very basic examples of using the relational operators.